OxyContin maker Purdue Pharma is nearing an agreement to plead guilty to criminal charges tied to its alleged role in fueling the nation's opioid crisis, several sources familiar with the matter told Reuters exclusively. The plea agreement under discussion is part of a broader deal to resolve probes by the U.S. Department of Justice. The deal, being brokered by federal prosecutors and lawyers for Purdue, owned by members of the wealthy Sackler family, could be unveiled within the next two weeks, according to sources, and could include billions of dollars in financial penalties. The talks are fluid, and the terms of the settlement could change due to ongoing negotiations. Federal prosecutors and state attorneys general have alleged Purdue engaged in aggressive marketing of a highly addictive painkiller called OxyContin that minimized the drug's potential for abuse and overdosing. Purdue has also been accused of funneling illegal kickbacks to doctors and pharmacies to drive up sales. Purdue said it is cooperating with the investigations and in discussions to resolve them, but declined further comment. Representatives of Sackler family members facing litigation and investigations either had no immediate comment or did not immediately respond to a request for comment. The company and family members have denied that they contributed to the opioid crisis. Purdue filed for bankruptcy protection last year amid an onslaught of litigation tied to its alleged role in the nation's opioid crisis. Any plea agreement with Purdue would have to be approved by a bankruptcy judge.